Enjoy this little huddle. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Literally last sentence. Menix 10.6, the next medium term support release is out now. And this video covers enhanced app management, new consume REST service beta, and more. And sprinkled throughout the normal topics, we'll share some interesting stats about the community in 2023. Let's dive in. Imagine how great it would be if you could ask a Mendix question and get an instant response with relevant links to information. Good news, you can, using Mendix Chat, a new feature that is now available in beta. It has the option to provide extensive feedback so that we can continuously improve it. We can update the systems behind this feature without the need to update Studio Pro, so it will keep improving automatically. This initial release uses the documentation, answered forum questions, and academy learning paths. Try out Mendix Chat now in Studio Pro 10.6. Did you know that you can have conversations and discussions with the community using the new Exchanges post type in the Mendix forum? Exchanges are a fun and interactive way to share your thoughts with the Mendix community. Create your own exchange at forum.mendix.com. We've made some big changes to the way you can manage your application landscape. You can now see the information of your apps combined with the information of your environments. This gives you all the filters and sorting options to slice and dice your app landscape in whichever way you want. With the new enhanced app view, you can focus on your apps in production or on managing your free apps. Even changing the technical contact or bulk deleting free apps has become a lot simpler. Check it out in the control center and let us know what you think. Did you know that users created more than 375 portfolio boards and 1,000 initiatives since the official release of Mendix Portfolio Management back in July 2023? Learn more about how portfolio management can help you align your business and IT goals at portfolio.mendix.com. The new Consume REST Service Beta was just launched. You can increase your productivity with the new way of consuming REST services because it changes the time to set up REST integrations from minutes to seconds, which makes every integration that you need to do significantly faster. You can test your calls directly in Studio Pro, do implicit mapping, and group REST calls together, making consuming REST services a breeze. Check it out now in Studio Pro 10.6. The improved Microflow and Nanoflow editors were released in beta in Studio Pro 10.4. Thanks to your feedback, the release of the editors in 10.6 incorporates even more improvements, ranging from additional logic bot suggestions to directly use counts, sum, and other activities on lists, to automatic loop resizing when adding new activities. Oh, and we fixed a handful of bugs as well. Enjoy this little holiday present. Did you know that we organized 65 meetups this year? That's right, we grew the Mendix meetup community to 21 countries this year and had almost 5,000 attendees. And next year, we're going to continue that growth, expanding to even more countries and organizing over 100 meetups around the world. Join the meetup community at meetup.com slash pro slash Mendix Baker community. Entity access rights are the most important security feature in Mendix, but configuring these rights can be challenging sometimes, especially when you have a lot of user roles and entities in your app. In Mendix 10.6, the new Entity Access Rights Editor shows the access rights for a single entity for all user roles in a single view. This way, you can easily see what each user role can do with the objects of that entity and edit the access rules if needed. Keep in mind that this improvement is currently in beta, so we don't recommend using it in production just yet. If you can't wait to use it right now, download Studio Pro 10.6 and let us know what you think. Did you know that the community collectively completed more than 80,000 learning paths in 2023? That is a staggering number of people who have learned how to use Mendix and leveled up their skills. With new learning paths being released on a regular basis, make sure to check out academy.menix.com for your next free Menix training. OpenAI in Catalog is now in public beta. This is a new addition to the platform that streamlines the management and discovery of REST APIs in your Menix ecosystem. This release provides automatic API registrations, effortless API discovery, and enhanced documentation options. If you're ready to upgrade your API management experience, visit the documentation to get started. 
For a full list of new features, improvements, and fixes, check out the release blog on menix.com slash blog, or read the release notes on docs.menix.com. Download Studio Pro 10.6 at marketplace.menix.com to use all these new features right now. I'm Jan Le Fries, your low-code host, and I'll see you in the next year. Happy holidays. Thank you.